uncharted territory for ODU basketball. Of course, we're midway through the season, and they had to take a two-week pause because of COVID issues. They were back on the court tonight at home against Marshall. Hard to know what to expect when you come back after that. Do you want to skip the first half highlights? Let's. Marshall led by 14 at halftime. It got worse before it got better in the second half. Monarchs trailed by 21. By the time Xavier Green hit this three, they were back to within four. Austin Trice had a huge night. 20 points, 13 rebounds, and a lead for ODU at 67-66. Nice passing on this next one. The back door to Green, it was 72-68 Monarchs. ODU shot 65% in the second half. Joe Reese connecting here. The Monarchs were without their top two scorers. So Jalen Hunter stepped up big in the second half at point guard. Alphys Palafios off the bench was great, and the Monarchs led 80 to 74. The Herd scored seven straight, though, to regain the lead. Not to worry, ODU faithful. In the end, Kalu Azikpe for the win. 82-81, tying the record for the school's biggest comeback in history. Pretty happy locker room after that game. Obviously, a lot of uh, enthusiasm, a lot of uh, happy faces and jumping around. Um, and, and, and I just very quietly, I, I told him I didn't want to spoil the fun. But, uh, you know, I, I wrote up on the board uh, team and I said that that's that's what it was. Uh, you know, the way we played, the way we were able to win, you know, it, I, I think uh, epitomizes what what a team effort is. I mean, that's just who we are. Uh, we will never stop. We'll never quit. I remember my freshman year, we was down 18-0 against Western Kentucky. We came back and we, we got it done. So we'll never stop fighting.